So guys, just got down to uh, a river, as you can see back behind us, fishing again with Jackson and Michael from Ozark Creek Bums. And we totally changed our scenery, as you can see, we're throwing some bass tackle. Loaded up the canoes today. Um, I know we were throwing bass tackle for giant trout the last several days, but today we're actually fishing this river creek right down here behind me. It just some random Ozark Creek. And uh, yeah, supposedly there's giant spotted bass and largemouth and smallmouth in here as well so we're uh, we're taking the canoes jackson and michael are going to dump a truck because we're, we're doing a float so we're gonna go down the creek kind of stop some of these holes but they got about 10 minutes before they get back here so we'll flip around this bridge see if we can catch them and that's a lot of current what's the best method don't fall Beauty, we're in. Yeah, I flipped I flipped one with my wife one time. It's because I tried to stand. Been getting any? Oh, we hooked up already. Are we really? What a cock. Spot. Damn, dude. Hell yeah. It is on. All right, we already got Michael over there. Right off the bat, baby. They're munching. With an Edward bass, spot Edward, flipping a jig. So I'm starting with the old inbred jig as well. Should be a fish. Well, it's good to see there's a few, huh? I need to put a different trailer on my yig. He's the creek wizard. I'm just gonna front end you in a canoe, no big deal. <laughs> Soaking the jig. There we go. There, there we go. Okay. All right. We're out here now. That's a large mouth. Hell yes. Just switched up to the uh, a different jig trailer. Threw on the old prawn. Got ourselves a large head. You bet, dude. That this is so sick. I'm so jacked right now. Beefy little large heads. We just tripled. Oh, I lost. Some I lost my canoe, my, my oar. <laughs> Up the creek without a paddle. There we go. What do we got here? What do we got here? Oh, it's a better one. Yes. Look at the colors on this one, dude. Dude, that's a big one. Yes. Just out here canoodling around in the Ozarks. <laughs> yeah, bud. Probably close to a three pounder. Oh my God. This is the first spot we just put the freaking canoe in. Michael was lying. There's no fish in here. <laughs> Look at that. Freaking inbred jig. Right next to that. Look at that, Cole. Get a shot of that back there. That's what he came off of. That was the fourth bite we've had in that spot. The old old school X bridge. Fuck yeah, I'm so jacked. Well, that spot was awesome. Had a bite. That little low. Oh, that was almost bad. Delicious jig, you're good, man. Breaks. Spot lock. That one. I'm gonna catch one over there. A leaf, that is, not a fish, a leaf. Got him. No Got him. Spinnerbait fish. Choked it, dude. 
That's awesome. Oh God, it's got weird herpes on the side of it. Dude, what is that? What is that? That is the grossest thing ever. No. I'm kind of jacked that I caught a fish on a different bait than just a jig, but I don't want to touch this guy very long. I act like that matters. It really doesn't matter, guys. But <laughs> warm enough. The water doesn't feel very warm, but. Oh, he got it. Man, they like the freaking spinner bait. I'm surprised. Got one. God, dude, this creek is loaded. Hey, what's up, bud? I caught a spot. Spot on a spinner bait. He's just down here living his life. Under my butt. <laughs> Jackson, help! Mr. Spotted Bass. Yeah. On the right side of the tree. Portage! My bad. I'm a little rusty. I don't know if we were gonna get on the right side of that though. Apparently they want the spinner bait too. Oh god! I saw that one come out and crush it. Dang, dude, these spots are mad at this thing. You bet. Spotted bass. It's the second one I got on the spinner bait. Love these things, dude. So beautiful. I just got this little painted blade spinner bait, really compact profile. I put a little divine swim bait on the back. He like it. Yep. Wasn't even paying attention. I wish I could have seen him come get it. Dude, this is crazy, dude. Crazy. God dang. Another spot guy. Wow. Oh, there's a bunch of bait in there. They just flipped when I threw in there. Oh, dude. Came up and got it. Catch any over there? That's a better one. It's uh, another spot. Or is that a largemouth? That's a largemouth. Just got the beautiful clean water there's no fish back here i wouldn't even throw dude it sucks back here i'm about to get on the main river i can't even catch one oh right at the boat yeah, he's out of his mind too dude that's a tank <laughs> i just watched him slowly fall out and eat it i just like let him grab it yeah dude that's a thick one damn son you bet another spinnerbait fish sweet another solid two and a quarter or so two and a half maybe exploring creek for the first time in a canoe Your heads. I want the bigs. Bigs only. I don't want the little pants polar downers. Think you wanted it? <laughs> Fish. Started off with a, uh, a double tail grub type trailer, but I switched up to this prom because Michael got a couple bites just like flipping a beaver as a, uh, as a jig trailer. And that's what I've been catching all my, uh, my jig fish on, this guy right here. Anytime we get around any of the shallower trees and stuff, 
pick up that spinner bait. It's not only really spinner bait conditions, the wind is blowing, but there's like no ripple on the water. Water's super clean, sun's out, no clouds in the sky, and they're uh, eating the spinner bait. I think it's something you guys can take from this. Clean, cold water. It's cooled down a lot the last, uh, last week or so. Bright, bright colors a lot of times can get bit from these fish, but I think a lot of it is due to the fact, too, that this is a very, very backwoods creek. I don't think anybody's fishing this back here. Just another one of the amazing Ozark Creeks, but I'm gonna keep flipping around. I hear stories of like three to five pound spotted bass in here. We've only caught a couple smaller ones, a couple really solid largemouth actually for a creek, but let's see if we can get one of those. Spot. Little spot of potamus. Nice little one. The jig there. But uh she is. There oh set the hook. Had it again. Let me go spook them. Hold on. Rocks in my shoes, Cole. Rocks in my Crocs. That was a good one, too. I just saw two of them right there. Yeah, I pulled them up over the side. I just didn't set the hook good enough. Gotta be one. It's deep. Back up there once. There we go. Lost one, you caught one. Not a babe. It's a good one. What is that? It is a smallie. The biggest smallmouth I've ever seen. Yeah. Yeah, he is. Freaking smallmouth. We did the trifecta. We did it. Done did it. Yes, you were just saying too. We got all these rocks on this bank right here. This is a smallmouth. Smallie. In the swimming pool. <laughs> Tiny. Smile, Jackson. We're just going in circles. Be careful, guys, there's a tree here. We're going to right in the middle. Whee! Yeah, that's a hell of a paddle back up, isn't it? Well, we started off a lot better than we, uh, we ended up finishing, but still, Caught some fish along the entire way. It's freaking crazy. We're on a damn creek. We, we launched off a highway. We're back onto another highway now. Um, but fishing these little creeks with these deep pools where there's trees built up and smallmouth and smallmouth and some of the random rocky holes and stuff like that. And largemouth and spotted bass. Pretty freaking, pretty freaking incredible. But um, yeah, spinnerbait, prawn, hybrid jig. 
flipping on stuff. Can't freaking beat it. But uh, yeah, we're actually, uh, we're loaded up. We're heading to another place. We've kind of been all over the place this trip. Done a lot of driving, it seems like, but totally worth it. Again, I will, uh, I'll link the Ozark Creek Bums down below if you want to go on one of these little adventures, go off the, the beaten path with Michael and um, head over to do some of his guide stuff as well on the, the river for trouts. So yesterday was trouts, trophy trouts, last night. And then all of a sudden we hop over here and we're catching three species of bass. But uh, more of that coming very soon. A smaller creek and a totally different creek, but another creek. It's gonna be awesome. See you then.